So that's it. Uh, should I go to Esther? With the tapes of wonders and secrets. But why you? Okay, I'm going to... Uh, I'm going for Esther. Is that old lady we like? We're trying to help her. With passion. Okay, I mean, she sounds really cute. She's young. Okay, Esther. You apparently really need me. Okay. Yep, I will. <laughs> Old parts. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we just were talking with this dude. Oh, machine parts all day. I mean... He doesn't have anyone else to talk with. Now us, but before... Wonders and mysteries. Okay. Okay. Defense mechanism. Hallucination paranoia. Memory and consciousness. Di Excuse me. It's a trap. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't. <laughs> I've heard it in the voice. I mean, good. That's kind of scary. Indeed. Okay. This is who this is from. Self ego, super ego. I've heard this before. Who was like basing something on all these things? Wasn't it like some very famous philosopher? I don't know. I don't remember. But like this, this feels very familiar would make sense someone was telling me that maybe there was someone in the station who could have kinda sabotaged it right from within oh, this is such a cool picture Hmm. Okay, supply zone. Okay, Esther. I'm going to the supply zone. Oh, wow. A lot of places to go through. And going off again. Don't mind me, guys. This dude is gone, and there's... Confirm receipt. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> okay. I don't mind me, I'm just looking around here. Why is that dude place planting? Or face balding? Was hinterland of the universe? 
Okay. Oh. Interesting. Dim blue dog. Oh, there are queens again. Oh. Oh, it's from this dude. Oh. Oh, so these are from him. <laughs> I mean... This is pretty cool. Okay, so Ankemoli kind of sounds like an adventurer, right? He had the train and he was like traveling from place to place, actually connecting the planets. Yeah, that's... He sounds like a good guy very good guy i wonder what is our connection to him right yeah like our character specifically <laughs> make a breakout like me Yeah, Lazara. So, former member of the Nameless. Armed archaeologist of the Intelligent... What? Intelligentsia Guild. Armed archaeologist. So, he was like, um, if I remember correctly, Nameless are people which do travel with a train, right? What is Intelli Intelligentsia Guild, though? Okay, I think I can look into it. Uh, no, I did not want this. I wanted this, so. Data bank. Uh, terms? No, 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 no. Delaron. Okay, this is not helpful. Character? Oh, it's, it's just this, okay. Eons? Akabili. Okay, countless shooting stars stray across the night sky. If you can pick the right one, it will carry your wish to thousands of distant worlds. Adrian Spencer Smith's Three directions on the compass of destiny. The unknown, the known, and the unknowable. They can tolerate the unknown. But will never bow to the unknowable. Akivili left the isolated world of Pegana and continued to expand the unknown edges of the universe, trying to find an endpoint of the tree of existence. Unfortunately, Akivili's destiny was abruptly ended due to an accident. Huh. Endpoint of the tree of existence. This, not gonna lie, this really reminds me of uh, Eden Zero, like traveling. Uh, through the space, to different places, and like our group, right, traveling through the space after someone who already travels, like Aki Willy, we are going on his trace, right? Yeah, and trying to go like to the, some kind of endpoint, and in Eden Zero, like the main cast is going after the 
root of um, what was the name of uh, Ziggy. They are trying to like go after his pod because they want to reach the mother in the space, whatever the mother is. But they don't know exactly like how the track is because uh, the androids forgot or their memory was wiped. So this really reminds me of that. Okay, um, the nameless trailblaze. Uh, mysterious strangers were seen to come and go in many worlds. A thousand years ago, the Elm Akuili travels across worlds, lying down the stair rail that linked worlds together in the Sea of Stars, and leaving behind countless legends about a universe and exploration. That sounds really cool, like very adventurous, and I love exploration. It's kind of like One Piece too. The brave and curious were attracted by the tales of these adventures and followed the steps of the trailblaze, joining the god on their journeys to explore the cosmos. The adventurers called themselves the Nameless. They rode the express created by Aquili and set off on thrilling adventures on planets connected by the star rail. Legend has it that Aquili the trailblaze loved journeying with mortals. Yeah, he seems like a very nice guy from all the eons we heard about, like the nor the one who is the most normalist. I guess he just really loved adventure. They and the nameless would share wine from various worlds and sing songs composed by diverse civilization. He just wanted to have fun. He was adventurous. I love that. They would disguise the moving express as the trail of a shooting star and laugh at the people looking up in Ave. However, they would often get into deep trouble due to their recklessness, only to be saved by the Eon's power. Akimili formed a deep bond with their followers, and their adventures continued to attract travelers to join the ranks of the Nameless. I mean, yeah, like, if you have a chance to go through the space to, like, see unseen and discover new things right with eon aki really like you would be stupid to not hop on that train when aki really fell a group of loyal nameless carried on what the eon had started continuing the exploration of the unknown they held the belief that one day they will the will of trailblaze will connect the entire universe the Astral Express that once carried Akiwili and their followers still hurries between the stars till this day. It is believed that the Express is powered by the heart of the deceased Aeon, and is repairing with great difficulty the star rail contaminated by the unknown cancer. Okay. Yeah, this is like super adventurous stuff. Kinda, okay, this really reminds me of Eden Zero and One Piece in one packet, and I love adventure. Like, the adventurous feel of both of these anime, I've really, really enjoyed and really, really love it. So, going through, like, from planet to planet, and discovering new things, excited. Okay, Astral Express. <laughs> okay. After the fall of Akiwili, the Eon of Trailblaze, their trailblazing will was inherited by their followers, we know, including the Astral Express that the Eon once rode on. However, as the cancer of all worlds okay, continues to spread, the star rails that the Express runs on also fell victim. The Express could barely run before the blight descended, and had no choice but to run around when the rails became overly obstructed. It remained so for many years, until a girl with red hair, so Himeko, discovered the desolate express. She was fascinated by the worldless stories, an engine, and the star rail had in store. She spent countless hours repairing the cracks and evening the dents, restoring the express to its original form. Like, okay, that's really crazy, because it's huge, right? And it was made by Aki Wheelie, and she was able to repair it to some amount of condition that it's like still okay going. The curious girl then set foot into the express and began her trailblazing voyage that surveys, surveys the cosmos. The Astro Express made stops at every station, with passengers boarding and exiting along the way. Many join and leave the express journey. 
the travelers come from different vaults, shoulders different burdens, and head to different destinations. However, while they are on the Astro Express, they would share the same voyage. That is why Himeko on the Express do not hesitate to open the doors to anyone willing to share this magical experience, regardless of their agendas and intentions. Yeah, because adventurer at heart. <laughs> okay, still on the hand hunters. Uh, 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 in, is, oh, Intellig Intelligentsia Guild. So he is here now. Okay, news. The erudition is eon of this. The universe is was and knowledge is universal. Both the genius and the mediocre have their own way of living. How I joined the genius society and become enlightened by hair <laughs> Jesus. Only the scream of the crop can become a member of the Genius Society, but the Intelligentsia Guild wastes not. The Guild is willing to accept all beings from the infinite universe who seek to learn, as well as providing all that is needed for the full pursuit of knowledge. Okay, that's really cool. Like, everyone who is interested can be part. I like that. Advocates that all knowledge must be circulated like currency. I also like that. Knowledge is extremely important. Therefore, although there are different schools that specializes in different subjects within the guild, everyone is actively engaged with one another with no isolation. Yeah, that's really cool. So they like share knowledge, which is very important. Members trade knowledge for wisdom and formulas for recipes, seeking to achieve mastery. Each school, like a business, pays for itself. An academic circulation has achieved the maximum efficiency post in economic models yeah that would be very efficient if like they can help like all the brands because a lot of things are kind of like i don't know you have biology right and biology is very important with chemistry and like all these things kind of are important and physics and like math and it is all connected an elder in the genius society taught the intelligentsia guild as laughing stock. However, as an open academic organization, the guild was above such mockery. I mean, they are doing what they believe in. They don't give a shit about these people and they're like, hey, we are sharing knowledge. We are learning as much as possible. This is what we wanted. It's functioning. We are happy. <laughs> you can shove it. <laughs> After a long period of research and exploration, its members have, have reached a consensus that the only way to transcend the limitations of the individual is to have an academic network of mutual learning. Yeah, because if you have a network where information or knowledge is shared, you would be able to like learn things faster because you would be able to like see the connections, for example, like, oh, this problem is connected to this problem from this, like, school, I don't know, which they, like, were able to come up with. And it's based on this problem and this resolution. So, it's really cool. I'm not gonna lie, that's really cool. Okay. So, that was a little bit of information we needed. <laughs> so, he was trailblazing. How long time ago? Himeko is quite young, so was it at a time Himeko? Like, found the train and like repaired it? Or was it before? Or like, when? And now he's part of um, the guild. Wow, there is a lot of these cranes. Dude, where are you? Are you setting these in front of me? Right? It was said archaeology. That's really cool. White table in a conference room. <laughs> okay. 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 
Gun Gonolev and Sheila Nova. Yeah. Oh no. Ouchie. Please don't hurt me too much with your tapes. Oh boy. Do I have time to read all of this? <laughs> An old friend or enemy? Okay, what? Some kind of conflict? Oh, when I ran. Business exchange. Oh, I guess he knew how to work in it. Hmm. Okay. Oh, so he actually kind of fled? Oh. Must fools pop. Huh. Some other organization. Oh, this is the one. <laughs> Obnoxious former researcher of yours. <laughs> I'm reading it in wrong order. <laughs> Farewell, Comet Hunter. Okay, I need to go for my quest. Okay, how... Oh, level 8, okay. And you are throwing the bag to me. Wow. <laughs> I was about to say, don't you dare, with some point. <laughs> Still surviving. Good. Wow. I even did not notice it has such a low amount of health. Critical. Me liking. Cool. This is cool. Oh, here. Okay. Neutrino explosions. Eagle Castle. Okay. Antimatter Legion. Okay, who are these people? Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Um, 
a wider red text, a space radio called Sheila, pursuit justice for the doomed planet, geopolitics researcher. Oh no. Oh my god. What? Oh, like here again? No, but improper information. Hmm. Clear the mental contamination. Oh, I'm walking slow. Guide paradox. I mean, sometimes, when you are stressed, for example. Yeah, that's more concerning. That's not a talent. You are born with it. There is no talent in that. You. Talent is something like you are also born with, but you are kind of working on it, right? But like, it, it does have nothing to do with, I don't know, um, physical health, right? Talent is something like you, yeah, you are kind of born with, but you also need like to do something with the talent, right? If you're not working on it, it won't help you. Oh. Yeah, indeed. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Shut up. It's all my memories. Welcome. Are you the founder of the Deputy of Galactus? Maybe she's just a person with the same name. Okay. Yeah. Maybe it was someone else. Could be. Hmm. Okay. Within a dark room. Brainwashing? Okay. Ah, <laughs> don't worry about it. 
Well. We'll see about it. Oh, of course there are enemies. Okay, oh, how big of a... Oh, level 8, okay. A big boys. Wow, she can just kill them with what? <laughs> one snatch, one pinch. Wow, she do. Yeah, that should be it. Ow, that hurts. Cool. Okay, where I was going? I need to take this and then go here. Ah, oh, more enemies. How big of a boy you are? Oh, level 28. So, for level 28, I need this one. Hmm, yeah. Okay. Okay. Do you have something else to tell? I need to defeat... Wow. Defeat his enemy. So it would be best if I choose... Hertha. This break is too powerful. Mm, 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 mm. Good. Yeah, yeah, ta 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 Awee awee. Leave me be. Come on, dude. Exactly. Okay. No! Uh, here it is. Probably. Okay. Oh! This? Gun Colonna. She was character introduction. Character. So is this a story? Okay. This is just a story. Someone has been, I guess, writing a story or something. <laughs> Such fabrication seems to be pathetic in contrast to her real life. Okay. <laughs> uh. That is true.
Maybe it was a story she might have thought of, right? And then she forgot. And now she's saying the same things <laughs> because it was the story she written down or something like that. Mario. Whoa. Been dealt with. How to cure? Man. Oh my god, it's there. Run, Hertha, run! Run, Kuru Kuru! Kuru Kuru! This is a treatment? Little accident. Okay. No. Oh. Okay. Okay. Just part of my hobby. I mean... I don't know what's going on. Maybe she was brainwashed to believe she's Sheila. Okay. Okay. See you're here? I don't feel so good. What? Bag online. Is she a robot? I guess. Oh. Oh, so he wiped her memory? Uh. <laughs> the plot thickens. Oh. 
How your scans could not detect she's not a human? What is she made of? Perfect recreation. Oh. S still, though? Hmm. That's kind of torturous, you know? The poor thing is so close to human and she's suffering like this. You cannot be wiping her memory forever. I don't think so. I un <sighs> three choices. Damn. Want to destroy her? But she should know the truth, also. Okay. How are you doing, Sheila? <laughs> Can an android dream of electric sheep? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, she deserves those if she is so much real like a human. She deserves to be her own person. Yeah. Dedicate everything to the department. She still deserved to know. I think she should know. Okay. Uh, master control here. Like, definitely not destroying her. Definitely, like, wiping her memory over again and again. Is still like... <sighs> she should deserve to be her own person. Okay, go on. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Damn.
Indeed. Indeed. True. Indeed. Guide Paradox. Indeed. Achieved. Okay. Like, the robot really deserve to know the truth. Maybe, like, the researcher, the dude, the gun, should try to do something about it so she would be her own person. I don't want her be to just some pretend fake whatever. What well, she's not, and she needs to, like, l have her mind reset it again and again and again. Like, that's horrible. You should work on her and make her own person. That would be so much better. And I don't want to destroy her because she d does not deserve that either. But they meet. Okay, what else I can do? Ring and stage. Oh, fight club. Simulated inverse, requiem mass. Okay, I think I'm going to do this now. Ah, oh, finally. I'm gonna deal with this three people here. They are so deep in thought. Why are you praying? Okay. <laughs> we don't even know what the hell it is. Okay. Yeah, I saw them. Identified creature. Stealthily like a ghost. Huh. I can help. <laughs> All excuses. <laughs> True. You are now saying exactly the same thing the researchers are saying. Okay. Okay, I'm moving. Okay. I should be talking with you. The justice fighter. Oh, uh, oh yeah, you're this person. Okay. Yeah, whoopa boom. So they're kind of staring people. Yeah, scaring people. Mm. Okay. 
Oh damn, that sounds bad. These two. Oh, these two. Okay. They are into something. Onto something, into something. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think we read about them. <laughs> Yikes. Yeah. They just like to do, like, sneaky and funny things. But yeah, this can happen. Okay. Oh, really? <laughs> really, aren't you? Right? Yeah. They might not be malicious, but like they might not understand what they are doing might be malicious. On purpose, so they might hurt them on purposely. <laughs> She's like, God damn, dude. We really don't know. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, okay. So we are going after the child here. Oh. Oh, he's having like one Wubabu friend. <laughs> you won't be able to scare him. Oh, it seems like it looks cute. It's so cute! It's so 
cute. It looks so short. I don't wanna hurt it. <laughs> this is me outsmarting you. Yeah. Auntie Hinko. Oh. Okay, so they play. Oh, it's so cute. Collective aim. Certain researcher. Okay. Never reveal our goal. Scariest of us all. Cool. If. Okay. A could at two. Oh. Yeah. We'll see. I mean, they're little mischievous bastards. <laughs> it's cute though. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Which monster? Where monster? Oh, here. Okay. Uh oh, down there. Oh, this is another working wrong one. Whoopsie. Here. Okay, uh where am I supposed to go? Leave me be. You won't survive for long. Like this, for example. Okay. Oh, yay. I'm gonna. Oh, there is one with Bubble. I see it. From the back. <laughs> I'm shameless. Wow, it's frozen. I'm gonna use this again. If I can, I will. Oof. Damn. Her to almost solo them. <laughs> That's why I love her. Goodbye. Okay. That's a level 8. 
Okay, booba boo. Where are you? Booba boo boo. Where it went? Oh, further? Somewhere around here. Okay. Oh. Booba boo is just so cute. Look at you, you little buddy. Oh, number one. Um, that's the only thing I have. Oh, speed reduction. Great. Good enough. Wow. Uh, you were annoying. Yeah, get out of here. They only have one win sheer, which is not enough. Because if there would be more, that would be better. Oh, or I can destroy them like this. So, what should I do? More win sheer? Okay, and now I can do this. Well, he only has a small amount of. Well, whatever. Okay. Okay, where, where are you, Wooba Boo Boo? Supply zone. Here. Okay, I'm going. Mm, here. Ooh -ha. Damn. That's a big boy. What a big boy it is. You are a big boy, huh? I'm supposed to go there. <laughs> That's a huge one. I don't understand how can people be scared of them. They're cute. Uh, wow, level 30. Well, wish me luck. Give me the speed. I can use this. And this. Good. Mm, I'm gonna use this on him. I need to get down with his HP. That one is the most dangerous one. Yeah. Yep. Feel the pain. Owie. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. They won't be able to do anything now. Yeah, these two are almost gone. I need to do something with you. I can do this. <sighs> Guys, 
God damn it. Oh, but the break. Whew. Saved my ass. Yeah. He hurts a lot. I'm in level 30. Again! You're annoying with this. He's going to kill me. <laughs> I need this. This might help a little. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, that helped me. Literature review. Huh? Hello, Wooba Boo Boo. Hello, Wooba Boo. Okay, wait a minute. I'm just going to look at my achievement. Collect 50 readable items from her the station. Okay. Nothing else? Nothing else. Booba boo being menacingly. I don't understand you though. Doesn't? It's kind of cute. Okay, where the hell am I supposed to go? Oh, here. Okay, I'm going to be... Uh... Here, okay. I need this. Like, really, really need it. But I healed myself, so... Oh, here you are. Oh, this one is scared. That one was mean. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it feels familiar. Oh, one's a Wubaba researcher and caretaker. Oh, protection net. Mm. Yeah. Meow. I smell some fuckery, but okay. I don't know if I should trust this. Map? Oh no, I'm going wrong. Whoops. Don't mind me, Mr. Monster. Oh, here again? Oh, that place. Oh, there's so many of them. 
Leave me alone. Why are you locking on him now? What's their problem? Good. Good. Very good indeed. You are so cute. What a weird noises they are making. Okay, am I now connected? I don't know. Oh yeah, I need this. Okay, okay, okay. I need the blue one, please. Thank you. Wait, uh, uh, uh. I haven't been here for a while. something let's have a look oh these looks very mean they look very mean <laughs> this one is scared these two are very mean I don't remember. Calm? Oh, sad. Oh. Oh. Uh, to me, it felt familiar. Seemingly feral and heartless. <laughs> they are very cute. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Uh. <laughs> okay, I cannot do it from this place. Uh, like this. Two sad woobaboos. Oh, here. Oh, you're so cute. Poor little things.
We'll see about it. You need a blessing. So I can be speaking with them. A <laughs> close encounter of the six kind. What? I can speak with them? But, eh, uh, mm, how, where, when? I want to speak with them. Choose repetitive dialogue option three times. Ouch. Obtain the ability to communicate with Wubaboos in the mission. Okay, C can I speak with them? I want to speak with them. Ubabu, can I speak with you? I want to speak with you, Ubabu B. Okay, what else to do? Oh my god. <sighs> you already know me, what is this? Himeko. Oh, this is about Asta something. This is about Natasha and this is about Hook. Okay. Mine, ring and stage. Oh, this is the ring and this is similar to the universe. I mean, I can try to go here. Ah, okay, girl. Yeah, I'm going. Oh, warp 2 unlocked. Um. Recommended team level 35. Great. I'm not of that. <laughs> None of that. Oh, God. For this one, 16. Yeah, I. First time clearance, extra drops. Yeah. Index. How was this? Well, heard that girly. Um, I'm going to go here then. <laughs> uh, this will need to wait. I'm going to the ring then. Okay, what do you want, sir? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not. Okay. Okay. Please, me, don't regret it. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Strength test. Okay. Oh, 24. I guess it will work. 
What is this music? That is truly chain of destruction. Okay, that wasn't very hard. <laughs> cool music. Yeah. Oh my. True. Completely new business model. Yeah. Set up the armor. He's such a horrible person. <gasps> Jesus Christ. No, I need a uh, math. Oh, that's a big boy! You cannot scare it, you know that. Well... Everwinter Shadow Walker. Okay, she still deals a lot of damage. He too. Cool. <sighs> you just needed to survive, huh? This ar dirty armor, I don't care about what damn it mean. Okay. I mean, it looks cool. Ha 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 
monster armor. Oh my god. Why does it need to be clean? We'll see about that. Oh. Oh, so I can like go inside? Really? Mr. Dick, where are you? Where, 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 where? I don't see anyone in the armor. Oh, really? There is. <laughs> wow. Hello there. I mean, it makes sense. He looks cool. Okay. True. They just want some cool fights. <laughs> 